So I'm doing my homework kind of like everybody else is, maybe maybe not right now, but um, I wanted to show you a quick trick with the uh, kitchen island countertop. Um, so in my kitchen here, um, this is my elevation. I want to have two little shelves here. Um, probably one is where I'll put the microwave, you know, other things like that. This trick you can use in your um, offices and also in your sample rooms. But the easiest way to do this is using the kitchen island countertop because it's it's really forgiving. So I have it loaded here already. Um, I've got it up there too, but here I'll stick it in here now so you can see it kind of live. So here, here it is kind of just floating in space. I'm going to put it, like I said, in between those two upper cabinets. So I'm kind of like lining it up right about here and I'm lining it up about here. And the nice thing with this is its handles will kind of let you go any width and depth you want. So there it is right there. If I look at it on the elevation, however, it, it came in correctly at what's typically countertop height. But here in my elevation, I can use the little up arrows and I'm just gonna literally just smoosh it on up till it gets up there. And it's about lined up right there. Um, I like that, that looks good. I also wanna put another one maybe midway up. So I'm gonna use the copy command right here. And I'm gonna say, I'm gonna use this edge. Oh, I might have to make that wider in a minute. And I'm gonna bring it up. Um, actually, let's do that now before we do that. We'll clean that up. So we'll clean it up right here in the elevation. Looks good on this side. All right, so I'm gonna copy it again. This time I'm gonna use basically the midpoint right here. See how it did kind of give me a little snap to the midpoint of my other cabinet up above. And now I have two of them there. So if you look at it in 3D, oops, wrong room. Um, there you can see my shelves here. You don't have to go and find a little microwave and all that if you don't want to. Because remember, we're only gonna be looking at this on plant. Oops, this guy got a little bit too far into the wall. Let's bring it out there. Oh, they both are, let's see. They both kind of smooshed back into my wall. But other than that, they're like at the height and width I want them to be. And I, I can make them skinnier too if I wanted to. Um, but that's a really easy way to get counters in your kitchen. Um, I might, like I said, this is what I did over here in my sample room. Um, and some of you I've been suggesting to use that too, just to make sort of custom desks and reception areas too. All right, so just wanted to show you that really quick as I was doing my own work on the end here too. Bye. <laughs>